Hi everyone, today we are going to find out how does your person feel about you today? We are going to have a look. So today being the day that you are watching this, not the day I've posted. Um, some of you might be watching this on the day that I've actually posted the reading, which is fine. Um, but yeah, it's a timeless reading in that sense. So what I wanted to mention is that this is for all star signs. If you're here, I think it can be a sign in itself that there are some messages for you. And also, what else did I want to mention? Um... I also wanted to very much so mention as well that if you would like to win a free reading with me, check out the description box below since I do giveaways every single month. If you would like to purchase any personal services, personal readings, intention items, everything is listed down below. There's items for love and reconciliation, twin flames, soulmate, um, there's, you know, evil eye protection items and... <laughs> it's it's all there honestly and the review section is at the bottom of my website so you can see how people have seen results with the intention items um you know it's bracelets and necklaces candles sage bundles items you can put under your pillow like uh, the embroidered cards and pouches um but also just wanted to mention as well that i do offer services like private paid readings and rituals to manifest different areas of your life black magic energy removal healing work etc as well okay so that being said let's have a look and see how your person is feeling about you today the sun is shining today which i you know gotta love that gotta love that in a country where the sun barely shines <laughs> okay let's see we've got here i need time to figure out what this all means and what i want we've got here i know that we are still deeply connected well they haven't this person hasn't completely let you go. There, there isn't that sense of like, you know, they've completely moved on. There's none of that. I, I don't sense that. I think that they're still just taking time to think about things. It's, they take a lot of time, okay? They, they take time to really understand their own thoughts. They take time to put two and two together. I think that you are much faster at putting two and two together. If you see a piece of the puzzle and you know that it matches with something, I don't think that you're thinking, hmm, I wonder if it's going to match. Maybe I'll try it. I think you just pick it up and you you try it. You know, you, you just are much faster at doing things than they are. And, um, well, that's just, that's just the way it is. So that's uh, what we have here. But they're still deeply connected. They know that you're deeply connected. Uh, you know, I, I think that there's, there's just that energy here. Um, it says here, I'm scared because I've never felt this way before. Well, there you go, right? The reason why things are difficult um, sometimes uh, with this connection and why it feels a little bit, you know, hot and cold and here and there, or if they have, you know, walked away at any point, they just have not dealt with the level of what you bring to the table. They, they haven't. They've, they've not known such strength in love. They've never known such strength in in that. And I think part of that is their conditioning from childhood and, and what they've seen as love. Remember, everyone loves differently. Everyone sees love very differently, right? Some people's love is, um, idea of love is toxic love. Some people's idea of love is the strongest of strongest loves um, and compromise. And some people think that compromise is not love. You see what I mean? So that's another thing here as well is that They've never felt this way before. They've never known a love to be like this, which I think is very important to, to know as well. Um, actually, do you know what? I'm going to use this deck. It's very colourful. I, th I think we should use this one. Okay. Trip and wait is what it's called. So, yeah, you know, you bring so much empathy and kindness to the table. They feel like that is so that is so incredible. They, they've never known someone to be so emotional in love. The Six of Pentacles, you're always so giving and understanding and caring, and they're starting to see that as a real superpower. They're seeing you as a superhero, I'm, I'm telling you, even with the Knight of Cups. Um, also, they look out into the world and see what's happening. And they start to see you as someone who is genuinely so caring. Like you are the kind of person that loves unconditionally. And I think that that's definitely something that is happening here. When I said superhero, I like genuinely do mean that they see you as someone who would go above and beyond in the most difficult of difficult situations. And what they're also thinking as well is that there are so many people who in very difficult situations would just always run away. <clears throat> this person. Um, so <laughs> just saying, okay, is that they know that they oh my god, this is like such a confession, and I, I, I really don't want to say it because it's not a nice thing to say, but they do feel like they can be very cowardly. They feel like they can run away. And now they're realizing that actually running away is probably the most cowardly thing to do. It's not a good thing to do, to be hot and cold. It's actually a good thing to stand by the people who are there for you. 
and that actually that's a strength. It's not a weakness, it is a strength. So actually they're starting to change their perspective on how they see you because before, I'm not gonna lie, they may have seen you as being too much, you know, like this is too much, that's too much, this is too much. And now they're starting to see you as someone who is genuinely so powerful, so strong, um, you know, it, it's huge. I mean, that is absolutely huge. Ace of Swords. Ace of Wands. Right, so. Clearly they have attraction and chemistry towards you. They're clearly trying to figure everything out. Okay, Knight of Cups here. They are so much more emotionally drawn to you today and they feel really connected to you. They have struggled tremendously in the past and that is something that they, you know, do feel very, very bad about. They don't feel good about the fact that they've treated you in the way that they have before. Um, the main thing here that I really just want to point out is the fact that today they are having some epiphanies and realizations that they have not been very nice to you. And this is also, sorry, my phone just vibrated, so, <laughs> um, but the main thing here is that they are realizing that you bring so much to the table and as they look out into the world and they see, you know, tragedy unfold and not so nice things happening, they're realizing actually that you are the right person. That's what's happening here. They're realizing that in difficulties, you would never run away. You would never look the opposite direction. You would stand there with them. And that is something that they are now realizing is actually what true love is all about. There you go, okay? Um, if anything, they're feeling like they're a coward and they feel absolute shame for treating you the way that they did. Big regret. Um, by the way, they're still figuring all of this out, okay? So I, I just want to mention that, like, they are thinking about these things, but they're they're still figuring it out, right? They, they need time to sort of put two and two together, and but they're, they're starting to put two and two together, if that makes sense, right? They still know that you're, you're like the right person, but they're still trying to put it all together. Um, you gave me that spark, so you know, that Ace of Wands is there for a reason. They feel that intimate attraction and chemistry towards you. I've been sending you th messages in 5D, okay? So you might be getting some spiritual downloads, spiritual messages, you might be feeling like, yeah, they are connected to me. And that's because they've been sending you those messages in a very spiritual way. I'm feeling the consequences of my choices and actions. Yeah, yeah, they are. They definitely are, okay? They definitely are. Because look, it, I was going to say they, they are not doing very well. They're like, they're really hurting and they do feel sadness over this. And literally the card, the next card is, I've been feeling, sorry, I'm trying to read this upside down. I've been hurting without you. You have no idea. There you go, right? They're still deeply connected to you. And then we've got here, I have an offer for you because they're going to come forward. They are absolutely going to come forward and we know that they're going to come forward here. Okay, and then we've got here, I've been putting myself first and I've been only seeing it's hurting me more. Yeah, see, they know. They know and you know. I think you know, right? That this is just what is happening. This is what is going on. But clearly they feel bad and clearly they do want things to progress and they do want things to move forward. I mean, they are literally thinking about how they can come forward and what they can say. I mean, they want to come forward. And the thing here is that they still need a bit of time to think about things and to sort of get things in order. So that's the other thing that I would say is that in, in their mind, they know that they'll come forward. In their mind, they know that they, they will make you an offer and they will say like, hey, do you want to, you know, work on things and get to know each other more and things like that. But they're still trying to like figure things out and they're also trying to understand themselves better because they feel like if they don't understand themselves better, how can they really provide to you what you also need, right? So then there's that as well. Um, yeah. So, uh, that's your reading. <laughs> I don't know what else to say apart from the fact that they just feel really bad about how they've treated you and they feel really bad about like leaving you in such a state, um, emotionally as well and just being a coward, um, which is interesting. So this is your reading and this is what we have. They definitely don't see themselves as very good right now because of how they've treated you, but that's what we've got. So if this resonates, if you claim it, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, comment down below. Check out the description box below for information on personal services, free reading giveaway, intention items. Um, everything is listed down below for your convenience as well. I also have TikTok and Instagram. If anyone wants to follow me on there, feel free to do so as I post short readings on there every single day. And I'll see you all very soon. Bye, everyone.